where we are. We've seen a couple of deer on a slip but the recovery is like sort of mission mission impossible too uh, but we've spotted another couple of hinds and uh, we'll just sort of watch that see if she grazes out into more of the um, uh, a more recoverable spot. Position, yes. where she, if she takes off with a round in the lungs as such she will She's going down into some pretty gnarly gutty area, so it uh, sort of bluffs off in there a little bit. So, uh, yeah, we'll get some camera on the uh, deer and uh, see what happens. Still early, so hopefully some more deer will present a better opportunity, but it's good. That's what we're here for, just a meat run, meat for the freezer. So, uh, yep, sweet. Ready? Three. Two. Mine's moving. Mine's not moving. Still not moving, too good. Sweet bro. Mine. Nice. Oh, I thought I that one boat. <laughs> Stash some of the gear oh, yeah. and uh then we'll head off yonder and go and get that meat off those um deer, yearlings. Both look like yearlings, so that's cool. Uh they'll have spied up another one um over yonder on a slip. Um, but we'll quite give that a nudge uh, tomorrow morning. We'll come and uh, hunt that and see what pops out. It's a little bit more of a recovery mission. That was the option too, because we had seen a couple there. So it's one still sitting out there, even after the gunshot. So I mean, it's a different sort of area to where we just shot. But anyway, we're going to get that meat and then hump it back to the accommodation and then have a feed. Okay. Yeah, I'll pop up there. Ready. Got my idea. Nice little entry hole. Sizable exit. Did it come out the Did you head shoot it? No, well, that's the entry there. So it's shot. You headshot it. <laughs> <laughs> mean as. Plenty of meat for you to carry. You <laughs> take those front wheels now. Shot. Interesting. Yeah, there's, another bit, there's another bit there. <laughs> oh, dude. So you got the deer right here, piece of meat, and then even another piece down there. It's pretty ruthless, the old 308 do you? Did the damage.
Mike's real hard up, so he needs all the meat he can get. <laughs> Too many kids. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it came out. Yeah. Mike's keen as for a 100% harvest here, so uh, he's opted to carry his little, <laughs> little deer out. Still got some backpack weight going on there. But anyway, <laughs> I was just going for the... Uh, well, I actually left the legs together, so... We can hang them in the chiller and then bone them out on the different uh, cuts, but here, anyway, head on back. Go and get our gear and then back to uh, campsite. Go for another nudge in the morning. Sweet. Well, not so much uh, luck on our first light. Came to our little glassing spot and nothing popped out. We are actually here in the, on our way back last night. And uh, we spotted a couple, but it was getting quite dark and one sort of spooked and gapped it. And the other just sort of went up the hill and was out of sight before we knew it. So we never really got onto those. Uh, but you go back around, check that slip out again, and then even uh, look further into where we shot those other two yesterday uh, but yeah just on the missions it's all good anything to say Mike? Uh, I've said it all <laughs> you sure? <laughs> yeah <laughs> all right let's go That one. So we're just heading around to Mike's there. You would have seen him sack it. Looked like a neck shot. And she's gone down all the way down into the creek. Or the river. This is where it all went down. Next shot. And she began to tumble. Down. Down to the abyss. Way down that way. Scene of the crime. <coughs> All packed up and ready to go. Dump the guts over there so the grass can decompose of that. And uh, yeah, let's get out of here. Full packs. Full packs, you reckon? Half a pack each. It's wrong. <laughs>